Sean, lovely to have you at the bar. Welcome. How does it feel to finally be in Real? Um, I'm excited to be here. Can't wait to get started. Really. Excellent. Tell us uh, a little bit for those who may not know you about what you used to do before you um, took so, up the role. Oh, so the last kind of few years, I've been coaching within the within the female game, but kind of in the youth team. So I've coached at London Bees, was at QPR before that, and then most recently at Oxford, been working within the RTC. Excellent. So obviously the, the role came up within the devs as Rishi's moved into the first team. How do you feel about taking that role and how did you find out about it? Um, so Rishi's someone who I've known for quite a few years now. We've worked together previously. So when he was given the opportunity to move up, he let me know and yeah, now I'm here. Thanks to, I think you played a key part in getting me in. Excellent. What is it in particular about the club that made you say, yep, yeah, this is somewhere I want to be? Um, so feedback I've got from players that I know have come here um, Rishi definitely from his year here and it's it's just such a welcoming club and I'm excited about kind of the ambition that we've got Excellent, we've been talking a little bit about the devs, you've seen them for training for the last few weeks, what have you made of what you've seen so far? Um, so I think what I'm going to have this year is going to be a very young squad but what I like about the club is that we've got the sort of the philosophy of if you're good enough, you're old enough. So it's an opportunity for me to help these young players and working with the guys in the first team and preparing those girls to make that step up. Have you spoken today at all about the philosophy? Were you sort of trying to mirror the things that the first team are doing and looking for players in each position or do you have your own sort of style that you're so looking for? Me and Dave had a really good chat. Um, it was so nice to kind of find someone who wants to play the game a similar way that I do and so I think we'd work really well together in making that transition as smooth as possible for those girls when they do make that jump. It's a little bit different for us this year. Last year the Devs obviously were in the WNL Reserve League which you would assume is maybe a slightly higher level than where they'll be playing this year. They'll be in the Eastern Region Division 1 which is obviously division below the first team. Uh, how do you feel our chances are going to be in that? Will you be looking to try and win the league on something like that? Or is it really all just about experience? Um, well, I want us to do as well as possible within the division. But I think it's going to present a very different sort of challenge. So we're now going to be competing against teams who are trying to get those three points every week. So we've got to compete and we've got to show what we can do. But I also think that it will help. So for any of the girls who are able to go and play for the first team it's they're used to the experience more so so playing against older players and adults just prepares them for what they need really excellent and are you ready for your first game of the season can you just be not waiting for it basically can't wait <laughs> no, for it all I, start? I can't wait so well our first friendly is this sunday looking forward to it and it's all, yeah almost there it's only a few weeks well welcome again and thanks for the interview thank you